Hey you guys, it is your girl Kia Viel in the building. I love my hair screen and today we have some makeup news. Finally, I feel like it's been forever since new makeup has come out. Like every brand took off for January and now they come to February and they want to give us all their bright ideas they've been working on. Absolutely here for it and excited for it. Our girl Huda from Huda Beauty is dropping a new collection. And it is the Maddie Obsession Collection, which is actually going to be a lot of fun. And we're going to go ahead and get into it, child. We ain't going to make this too long. So the very first palette that will be coming out is the Cool Maddie Obsession. And this is the picture on Instagram on the Huda, on the Huda website right now. Um, it says it's a mix of icy mauves, dreamy pinks, pastel purples, and frosted browns. It's going to have a total of nine shadows in the palette. And this palette releases on February the 27th. Now listen, I know some people will be underwhelmed. Some people will love it. The formula is beautiful, okay? The last palette she came out with was the Empowerment palette. Loved everything. Okay, the pigment was pigmenting in the most pigmentitious of ways. <laughs> so we have pictures of swatches as well on the website. These are what the swatches are. Very cool neutral colors. I feel like if you don't already have a palette with all of these in there, then this is definitely your girl. Or if you have neutral colors, but they don't have that kick of a pigment like these have, then girl, you want to go ahead and get your hands on this. So this one is the Cool Matty palette that'll be coming out. And then there's going to be another palette coming out by your girl. So it is the Warm Matty Obsession palette. And this is what it looks like. This too is also on her Instagram page. You guys should follow her because she be posting a bunch of new new. Follow Huda Beauty and, and follow Kayla. Okay. Follow that. Kali. I say Kayla. It's Kali where you find out the perfume because they're sisters and they be doing it out here in the beauty industry. Okay. They be doing it. So it says that this palette is a mix of toasty terracotta, rusty orange, pretty peaches, and rich browns. And this is going to be coming out the same day as the Cool palette on February 27th. And they both have nine eyeshadows in them. Okay. And we also have swatches of those as well. And this is what it is. So she said that these are highly pigmented and that there is a total of seven powder matties. And then there are two cream to power or, or powder based shadows that can also be used as liners. Because you know she likes to be multifunctional when she come out with her palettes. You know what I mean? It's always some type of creamy one. Always something you can do a lip liner with, an eyeliner with. She want to make sure she cross, crossing all her T's and dotting all her I's when it comes to her palettes. So, I think that this palette is absolutely beautiful. I really hope that the pigmentation is how it's looking in this picture. Because this looks really, really great. It looks like a palette you're going to get a lot of use out of. You know, neutral tones is something you can pull off every single day. And I mean, you don't have to be neutral. You can be out there too. You can be bright and, and pigmented all the time. But it's nice to have a couple of neutral palettes for a nice clean look. So I think she did really, really good with this color scheme and this colorway. Now, do you need both palettes? Let's look at the swatches. Which one is your favorite? Is it the cool or is it the warm? Let me know in the comment section down below. I don't know. I'm really liking the warm, but I'm a brown girl. So y'all know I love brown, warm stuff. This looks nice, but I feel like I don't know if I would get a lot of use out of this one as much as I would this one. So I think I'll probably just go for the warm palette because of that fact. Because it looks like something I would really reach for. But this thing is nice too. I don't know. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I guess we have to find out February 27th. The only thing she did not tell us, child, is how much the palette's going to cost. That's what I don't like. I probably should have looked back at some old palettes and saw the prices. And then I might be able to tell, you know, what the price could be. Um... But they're probably going to be like $30. It's my guess. My guess. She has yet to disclose that information. Um, but I'm not mad at it. I'm not mad at these colors. I'm not mad at the pigmentation. I mean, there's only so many colors a, a, a people can make. 
<laughs> so if you feel underwhelmed by it, I mean, I guess you can just pass up on it. But I think it's really nice. And I think it's going to be that pigment that separates these palettes from your other palettes based off them swatches. It looked pretty good. So that is today's video. That is what I just found out to tea. I wanted to share it with y'all. So let me know. Y'all going for these palettes? Y'all passing? Y'all got enough neutrals? Y'all need more? <laughs> I'm just glad my makeup is coming out because listen, ain't nothing been coming out and I miss it. I miss doing swatches. So yeah, that is today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate you guys. If you like content like this, definitely like, comment, and subscribe. I thank you once again. And you already know, I will see you later. Bye.